All right then guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I'm gonna be having a quick talk about the tweet released by Mr. John Unishek. If you don't know who that is, that's a developer on the 343 team, one of the main guys. And basically today he released a tweet talking about the new Halo Infinite playlists, which are gonna get added. So from what we see here, we're gonna be getting Fiesta, Tax Slayer, also known as SWAT, and also Free For All, but they won't land by December 8th. Now it is good that we're getting these, but Jesus Christ, is it late? They didn't need to be this late into the game. These are like, in my opinion, these are sort of day one launch games. They're the base game types, along with Slayer and all the rest of the basic stuff. This is basic. And also another, not trying to be like, you know, an armchair developer, but a feature to let us just simply select which game mode we want to play and allow us to play it. That would have been nice as well, because that's how it's always been. But, you know, got to rely on the look of Halo Infinite to uh, get, my, get my desired game mode. All we know is these are going to come in before the holiday, but just not December 8th. So say you're talking two to three weeks. Considering Halo Infinite's got a bit of a, a, bit of a decline in players, understandable, because it, it does get kind of boring when we don't really, you know, when we can't select what game modes we want with just the lack of game modes in general. It's understandable, but we have got the campaign coming on December 8th. So in four days time as of recording this, because it's, uh, it's one minute past midnight. That should help. That made any sense. You know what I'm trying to say? With campaign coming, it should give it a bit of a revive. Nothing bad, though. I mean, Infinite's still got a pretty decent player base, but it could do with a bit more, you know, a bit more of a revive. But other than that, it's, it's really going strong. So I am proud. Well done, 3 for 3 But some of these just haven't been thought out well, I don't think. You know, it, it just it could have been done better, but so far I'm happy. It's just it's just a shame that we can't get this stuff in quicker. I mean, live service, it's, it's meant to be updated quick, but... That's not going to happen, unfortunately. I don't know why. I mean, if I was 343, I'd be racing to get these game modes into that game ASAP with a feature as well that allows us to choose which game mode we want to play, you know? It, but it is what it is. At least it's going to get done, so I won't complain too much. But uh, yeah, just, just a bit of an update and also another update for my channel. This act, this actually links into what we were just talking about. I actually don't know what video ideas I should, I should you know, go ahead with. I don't really have any video ideas due to the lack of content in Halo Infinite. I can't really make any videos because I don't know what to make them on because there's nothing to video. <laughs> I don't want to resort to making 30 second long clips of weapons that we, you know, that we've seen like 20 million times due to other people making clips. I don't want to be that guy just does clips. I want to try and think of some stuff, but I, I genuinely can't. So that's a lie. We, we have had an idea. Well, I should, I should say, I have had an idea. The idea is get a custom game video out, but oh man, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, anyway, I'm going to leave you to it now and hopefully in the next few days I'll be back with another another proper video and probably a custom game video. Of course, Halo Infinite custom games has to be. And, uh, I might even try and get out a modding video. Well, when some mods actually come out for MCC or Infinite, either one. So anyway, do take care. Stay safe. I hope you enjoy. I'll see you on the 8th of December for my episode one of my Halo Infinite campaign walkthrough with commentary. And again, I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.